And I went back here and I started looking, and I found little little paint things, glass. I'm telling you what, I'm, I'm about to do this shit. Look here. There's a piece right there. There's a lid. There's another lid. Here's the one that I just picked up off the ground. There's the stuff on my van. And it's on top, too. Now, for them to have that drone, they had to have been close. Why do you think it's a drone? Because I come out of, out of the out of the back house and I walked up this way, and that guy right there in that house there told me that he seen a drone dropping. Okay, you have a camera here. Did yeah. you catch anything? Yeah, it it don't show the drone, but I see it I have it coming down. You, can I see that? Um, hold on a minute. Hey, Dad. Bring your camera here. Bring your phone here. Yeah, can you can you show this off? Add this plate to the call. Oh, you add a plate? Twenty. Go ahead. I'm, Just tell them twenty add a plate. Break. So go ahead. Yep. So add the plate in the vehicle. I've had enough of this shit. Oh, you know where it's coming from. I mean, as long as he's online doing. What he's doing, you're gonna get. Well, you know what? Yeah. Well then, well then, you know what? I'm gonna find him and I'm gonna fuck him up. I'm over it. This has been going on too long. Who, who is it? Like, who do you think it is? His name is Marty. He said Marty lives in uh, Illinois. Illinois. Illinois, dude. He can't fly a drone from Illinois. No, he has, no. They it, pay, pay people to come around and do stuff. Okay. This is this is bullshit. They broke the front windshield on my car. Well, okay. How do they know where you guys live? It's all over, it's the, all internet. over the internet. Are either of you guys online? No, I don't get online. So how else will they? My son does. Yeah, no. It's the root of all your problems. No, they're the root of all our fucking problems. Well, him showing his ass and his genitals online is part of your problems. Well, you, you see that one there? I do. And there's other ones here? Last time when they dropped the fucking red paint on the front of our house, I gave the cop the way to it, and he handed it back to me. Okay. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm tired of this. And if, and if, and if I got to go to Chicago, I'm not going alone. If you go to Chicago, you're going to get in trouble. Well, no, I'm not, because... What, listen to what I'm saying. What proof do you have that this dude is doing any of this? Because I know he's because doing Because they will, what, they will... That's, they, that's not my question. What proof do you have? Because understand, if you go and you attack somebody, you say, "Well, I know he did it." You're going to prison. Well, you okay. know what? I got I got shit on my phone okay. of him saying that he's going to do this and that. Right. And I'm I'm so over it, man. I am over it. He's in Chicago. I don't give a shit where he's at. I'm over it. I hear you. But you know the thing is, you guys don't do nothing. What you, you can't do nothing. Proof do you have that this guy is doing anything? Do you understand how many people chance argues with online? This oh, could yeah, be, but it's all this from could the same be guy. Literally anybody. It, it it's all from okay. the other front. It's all from him. Okay. All right. I'm kind of glowing the dark shit. You know, I'm I'm, I'm just over it. So I, just, I understand you're over it, shit. but I mean it's. You know, it's the same thing years. we talked about yesterday, boss. I'm so sorry. It's the same thing we talked about yesterday. Yeah, well, you're gonna you keep know, having issues as long as he's online, going back and forth with people. I and, know it's him because he he dropped he was flying a drone and dropped the red paint on okay. the on you the front of the road. You can't fly a drone from Chicago here. No, but you can drive a drone from the to park down here. He's so in Chicago. Park. So he is not doing anything. Well, you, how do you know he's in Chicago? How do you know he ain't down here at the park? Okay. I, how I'm do you sorry. know he's I'm here? You're good. What I'm asking is, the law doesn't work off of what you think it is. I know it so, is. So, what proof do you have? I have proof of him doing doing the front of it. What proof is that? That that he's the one. He's the one admitted that that he dropped the dropped the red paint on the front on the front of the roof. What do you mean he admitted to dropping the paint on the floor? He admitted on the internet that he was the one that had people drop drop the shit. So off. he had people drop it off. He he, he told us that he him and four other guys that had the drum that knows how to run the drums. Okay. Dropped the shit on the front of the roof. 
Not, you know, I'm, I'm tired of this shit. I understand that. What I'm saying is, I mean, same I mean, thing we said they, yesterday. They tore down our fucking fence. They broke out the windshield of my car. And, you know, all this shit. They, they send people here to pick up um, scrap. They send people here to clean out the garage. They send people here to clean out the basement. They send people here to um, pick up copper. I'm fucking tired of it. I understand that. How do they have your address? <laughs> it's all public knowledge. You can go and you can pull up anybody's address. Well, you can't. <laughs> it's all public knowledge. Okay. What is it that you're looking to have done here, boss? I know what you want done, but what I is want, it that we can do? I don't know. I, I just want you guys to realize what's going on here. And you know what? I know what's going on. I, 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 I'm, I'm going to I'm I'm tell them I'm going to come two. here. Come here. Quit okay. hiding behind that, that computer and your drone shit and come here. I'm, I'm over it. Okay. That's... And then when he, when he comes in and steps in my yard, I'm going to shoot the motherfucker. Because I'm tired of it. You're gonna go to prison. No, not if he's on my, not if he's on my. You can't shoot on my somebody property. for standing on your property. Okay. See, this is this is all we get from you guys. Nobody wants to fucking help. If us. you come to my house and I shoot you because you're standing on my lawn, I'm going to prison. Yeah, he did okay. not threaten you. He did uh, not do whatever. anything to you, whether you I'm, want I'm him there or not. I understand tired you're tired, but I'm telling you. How the law works. Because well, you're tired of it, you can't just shoot somebody, all right? I, okay. I mean, technically, you can do what you want, but understand there's consequences. All well, right? Yeah. Well, okay. you know, there's, there's consequences for him to do that. Well, he's not. Okay. You can't tell me that he's not here because you don't know. You can't exactly. Do Dude, he just told us yesterday that he was in Illinois. You just told us he, he, he in lives in Illinois. But he comes down here. He he, he rents his beat. He comes down here and he's renting stuff out. Because how do, you, how do you know? What proof do you have that he's doing? Because her son and him got in a fight, so they were they were over here at the B and B. Did you see him? I didn't see him. Did he see him? Yes, he seen him because they got in a fight. When did when did he see? Him? This was probably I don't know. It's been a while ago. I'm just over it. They got into a physical it. fight because you guys won't do. Did nothing. they get into a physical fight? Into, yeah, yeah, they, yeah, they got into a physical fight. Yes. Did you see it, or is that from what he's telling you? That's from what he's telling me, and he okay. came back with, with marks on marks on him. Okay. Okay. What's your name, boss? I'm just tired of it, dude. I was uh, explaining yesterday. You said you're tired of being here and tired yeah, of going through it. I understand that. Nope, I got it. What's your name, boss? So, I understand that the irritation is that we're not doing anything, but as I explained to you, I have absolutely no problem charging this dude, arresting this dude, but we have to have some type of proof that it is this guy. I understand that Chance says it's this dude, you're saying it's this dude, but understand that Chance argues with almost literally everybody online. I understand that. All right? Between him arguing with people, what he posts online, he, honestly, he's even shit on us a couple times. Yeah, I know it, that. I know that. So he argues with literally everyone. It's not hard to see him walking down the street and notice who he is. I mean, people throughout the city knows who he is on, on YouTube. They talked about it before I even started here. Okay. So he's he's known. But so him showing his private parts and his I ass understand. online, he's going to have a lot of enemies. And then him continuously shitting on people, he's going to have some issues. All I right? understand that. So it can be literally anybody. I understand you think it's this guy, but literally anybody could be doing this. Okay. All right. So we just need some type of proof of who it is. So if you want, we can do a report for you. If I'm being honest, it's not going to do anything for you because we have no information as to who it is. So it would literally just read, you caught us for something getting dumped on your car. It's an unknown suspect. And that well, would be okay, their, here's the thing. It. Yes. Okay. Can you do something about the drone? It, a drone's not allowed to be flying over my house unless we give them permission. That's not true. It's public space up until a certain height. Oh, okay. All right. Well, then... And then that's wrong then, right? As long as it's not crossing whatever, don't quote me on that, but whatever the restriction is for the FFA or whatever the airline is, because even our drones, we have to request permission to go up so high. But to just fly it around the neighborhood 
and they're still working on the restrictions for drones. It's still a new thing, but as of right now, there's nothing stopping people from driving drones over. So, okay, all right. Now, so, so if you had like a privacy fence or something like that, and it is now like in your space, like in the windows, stuff like that, you might have some issues there. Um, but if it's just flying around open land, there's really nothing right now that restricts that. Like I said, up into a certain height when the airlines and the, I think it's FFA steps in for the airline safeties and whatnot. Right, well, that would be like the helicopter flying to the... Yeah, up to a certain height, yes. Yeah. But right now, like I said, to my knowledge, there's nothing restricting just the common like civilian drone flying around. Because that's what everybody's doing right now. I'm sorry, man. I'm just tired of it. I understand. I completely understand. But we you just got to have some type of grounds as to who it is. Can we take this stuff here and get some... Fingerprints off of it? Off the liquid? You know, off the cap right there. There's a cap laying right there. There's so, a cap laying right there. There's two of them. And I there, see that one right there. That's so the third. they only send out uh, things to get fingerprinted for like felonies. So like shootings mm -hmm. and vandalism, things like that. That's vandalism. This would be like, you might be able to push criminal damage. But it didn't. So vandalism is any damage to your structure. Say like if somebody booted your door in and you're here, that could be vandalism. But it would have to be something that happens to the house. I actually, so just had a case. So that's not where vandalism. Then. This is not vandalism. No. Like I said if anything, it would be possibly criminal damaging for defacing the property. But I know it's annoying, man. I'll, I'll be annoyed. I'm, but I am over it. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get. You, you're good. I didn't take anything personal, man. I'm just saying, like, something with his whole internet uses has to change. It's what's causing you guys' issues. I mean, you know that. You said it yesterday. Right. As long but as he's online. I just don't understand why they, you know, they, they damaged that. I can't get to my doctor's appointments. I just got out of surgery five months ago. They yep. did. They, uh, they went from C2 to T2 and on my back. Okay. You know? I have nowhere to go anyway if they mess this up. You I know understand. I am here to tell you, man, they probably don't care. Yeah. Well, Not don't a care. lot of people don't care about other people's property, man. You have a water hose or something? No, I don't have no. I, I want to get like a, just, I don't know what this is. You might want to just throw some. Water. The dark stuff. Yeah. Like, might want to just throw some water on it, it. I think it's paint myself. Paint? Nah. Uh, it doesn't like look a, like paint. Yeah, it's like a, uh. Like a glow in the dark, like looks like some goo or glue something. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, like a glue, stuff. some type of glue base. Because you can look at it and you see it turns green when it gets dark, when that light stops. No, don't put the light on it. Though. Okay. But you can see like the ground was lighting up. See how it's lighting up green? Yeah. 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 You got a BB gun? No. Mm -hmm. Say if things flying over your house, dumping stuff on your I car. I got something bigger, but I don't, uh, you I don't can't. know if I want to pull yeah, it you out. You can't do that. I mean, and I yeah. do have a paintball gun. Well, paint it. If it's flying over your property, dumping it on your stuff, I'd shoot a paintball at it. So I guess I should uh, stay up 24 7 so I can watch my hand, right? Oh, well, no. I mean, it's probably some type of indication. When this is happening, I don't know well, if, if Chance is still arguing with somebody or like, hey, I'm about to come do such and such. There's probably some indication as to somebody, or he's probably. So they didn't come last night, right? What happened between last night and today that provoked somebody to do that tonight? He's probably arguing with somebody or something like that. Well, right. he's up in this room, and I, you know, I'm downstairs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's got the internet. See, that's a whole other thing. If we do that, okay. So well, you, like, would you rather have your would you rather that have your, like your property damage, or would you rather have him yelling at you over the internet? Well, I, I'm not taking this. I'm not taking this yelling. See, I'm not the dad. Nah, I'm the I'm the boyfriend. Okay. I'm so, sure. you know, I I can't really do. You know what I mean? I I gotta I mean, agree with whatever she says. Not necessarily, man. Yeah. You guys are you together. Play. You're sharing a residence together. I mean, I just, how long uh, you guys been together? Seven years? Eight years? Eight years. Eight years. I'm just saying, I was with someone, we moved in together, and she's got this adult son who's running amok, causing issues. 
we need to have a conversation. Hey, your kid either stops what he's doing, he needs to be out on his own, honestly, but if he's not going to do that, then we need to figure something out, or I can't be a part of this whole ordeal. That's, it's crazy, man. It, it's really crazy. Like I said, they, they tore down our fence, they busted out the windshield, you know, they, they dropped all that stuff in it. I told you, I don't know, it was mm -hmm. with you, they, all the concrete stuff on the porch. No, it wasn't me. It was the, the other guys that was with you last night? I don't know. The other two cops that was with you? Yeah, well, there was possibly. two cars. Yeah, the, so there was me and him, and then there was the uh, the guy with, the, like, the beard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, I told, I told him that. They, they dropped, uh, two weeks ago, 64 bags of concrete on our front porch. 64 bags? Yeah. Did you see who it was? It was uh, Uber. They, they were bringing, each vehicle was bringing so many. One vehicle bought and brought 20 bags. I can see that, okay. So they just dropped it off on your porch? Yeah, they, they dropped 20 uh, square blocks. They dropped... Um, were you guys here? Yeah. I, I tried to stop them, you know? Did you ask them who sent it? Well, after everything, after every, all we got was a visa number of one of the receipts that they okay. left. Okay. I mean, you know, it's crazy. Oh, yeah, it glows. Um, yeah, whatever's in it glows. A big, a big bag, a bag of bird's feed, uh, eight gallons of water. Um, let's see, what call else? This them, them hub drinks. Now they say, uh, well, then, then the next week they drop 20 bags. I caught the second person. And I, I sent them back, and then there was another person that came out, and he got three bags out of the back, back of his vehicle, and I took the one and threw it up on his car, and I told him, I said, take him back. Well, he pushed it up on the, on the driveway, but he left. So hmm. then I got, got in, it was coming from Lowe's, the new Lowe's store up on Howe Avenue. That's why he has to be, Chance has to be arguing with somebody with some money to be just paying dues to do this. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, it's, it's crazy. It's, uh, and like I said, I'm sorry for, for being I mean, I'm just, you know, I'm... Uh, I understand exactly where you're coming from, man. But, I, I mean, mean, if it was your like, it's like you said, you would be all pissed off. Yeah, I'd definitely be pissed off. But you got to understand, though, being pissed off isn't going to change anything. So you're pissed off, but unless something changes, it's probably going to happen again. Something has to change. You know what the root of the issue is. Either something changes with that or... Uh, you make a decision. So, I personally, I would only be pissed off so many times. I mean, your car has been messed with, the house has been messed with, people dropping stuff at, off at your house. I mean, that's it. I'm only going to be pissed off so many times. Something's got to change. Yeah, well, and two, I mean, on, on, on top of that, probably 20 texts a day, probably 20 phone calls a day. And if you change your number, with my, my girlfriend changed her number and within three days, they had a number. It's not like it used to be back then. Yeah. You know, I it isn't just, hard to get a get a phone number. I've found that out. It's not hard you know, to get a back in the old number. days. You used to be able to get an unlisted number. Yeah. Now, now you can't. You can block. What are they calling you? Like unknown or just yeah, random numbers? Uh, just random numbers, and it's and it's not the same number all the yeah. time. You can make your phone so you you don't get uh, calls from people whose number you don't have saved. You can also block. Unknown callers. So if they call you private, you can block those. And like I said, you can block people. Like if you were to call me and I don't have your number saved, it wouldn't ring through. You can do that too. Well, I don't know that much about you know all that. I just I'm still learning. Let's say Google it or YouTube it. But yeah, like I said, I mean, he's arguing with different people every day, he's creating nothing but enemies. Uh, I was getting ready to. For being honest, a lot of people who sit down on a uh, on social media all day, have nothing but time. So, nothing better to do. If you piss them off, and what what better way to spend their time than to mess with you? Yeah, well, I understand that, but the thing is, we're not. Me and her's not doing anything. Well, yeah, but he lives here. It's the, it's the house they associate with him. Right, I understand so, that. They probably don't know if you guys live here, or it might, but it's all associated with him. So, I mean. If I take off, then it's going to be all, all on her. That's not your problem. If you stay, 
something you guys got to figure out. But if you decide to leave because of what's going on, you guys have talked about it. She, is she willing to change anything with him? She told me last night that it's just got to stop. And you see what happened tonight. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a start. Is, is she actually moving forward with that? or she, she, she told him to sit down and shut up. And I was right there, and she told me this shit's got to stop. She's like, it, it's driving her crazy, too. Mm -hmm. Has that ever happened before? As far uh -huh. as her? Has, has she ever took a stand with him? Let him know, like, hey, this is not happening anymore? That's what she told him last night. And was that the first time she's... Okay. Pushed it forward, you know, but okay. I mean, I've been telling you, you gotta stop. We didn't really, we didn't really know that he was doing the things that he was doing on mm -hmm. until last night. Right. She, she straight up asked him, "Hey, are you doing this?" Yeah. Well, why are you doing this? Gotcha. You know? Yeah, well, that's a start, son. We're telling him he needs to stop, and I said maybe she restricts him to use the internet, and kind of go from there. Maybe he'll get an understanding. Like, okay, maybe I need to stop. Or maybe he won't. I tried to explain to him what the big issue was last night, and he didn't seem like he was understanding what I was saying. Oh, well, he understands. He just wants me to think that he don't understand. I think you told me that before. <laughs> Maybe the first time he, I was you know, here. He's, he's months smarter ago. than people think he is. Yeah. I definitely think you told me that before. Okay. All right, well, I, I guess I better get a bucket or something and get that off the van before it dries. Yeah. I said, if you see the drone... And it has something to dump on your car. I, I would per, I'm not telling you what to do. Okay. I don't know the repercussions, but I would hit it with a paintball. It's flying over my house, dumping stuff on my car. I'd hit it with a paintball. But I would not just damage a drone that I see flying around if it's not doing anything. Because it could just be a neighbor or a kid or something like that. But, however, if it's something you see somebody dumping on your car, then Like I said, it's still a new thing. They're still creating the guidelines and laws around it. But it's a pain in the butt right now. I probably should get get a broom on here and sweep the glass up too. Yeah. I mean, it's worried about like walking on it. It's not gonna hurt the, the wheels at all. It's too small. Well, I, no, but we, you know, it's gonna hurt my feet. Yeah, that's <laughs> what I'm saying. Like walking around, yeah. Uh, uh, I mean, it's just all right. All right. All right. Of course, call us if you need us, boss. Like I said, I know it's a pain in the butt. Something's got to change with them, though. All right. All right. Take it Thanks, easy. Guys. No problem.